In today's video, I'm gonna to talk to you about whether or not you need an LLC. So you probably clicked on this video because you wanna learn a little bit more about whether or not you need an LLC for your business ventures. I'm Andrew, I'm an attorney from Molai Law, where we help entrepreneurs just like you start your businesses without having to deal with the complicated legal forms. We are the highest rated business law firm. And as I'm speaking to you, we currently have over 2,150 five-star Google reviews. In today's video, I wanna go ahead and talk about whether or not you need an LLC for your business ventures. So I'm assuming that you've been searching online on Google, whether or not you need an LLC for your business. You've been doing your research and you've heard these point of views and those point of views. The thing with searching this question up is that there are so many different types of opinions out there that it's hard to determine whether or not this answer or that answer is correct. Well, I'm here to provide you with more clarity. In fact, I'm gonna go ahead and provide you with steps, a concrete answer that will save you time on doing even more research that is unnecessary. When it comes to forming and registering a LLC, also known as a limited liability company, Registering an LLC is the most simple business structure for individuals who are starting their business on their own or if they are a smaller business. One major reason is the operation and management of the daily activities. The management and operation of the daily activities are extremely straightforward when it comes to owning and operating an LLC. Additionally, you will be able to experience tax benefits. And this basically means that you will not be subject to double taxation. Many individuals and many clients that I've worked with in the past start off with the mindset that my business is just going to specialize in this specific niche. But with all things good, if you dedicate your time, if you're disciplined, and you stay consistent, your business will grow past your initial niche thoughts. Basically, what will happen is you'll begin your business ventures. You may start off with an email list, and then those email lists will turn into something more. You'll start getting referrals, and those referrals will start referring other individuals. And by the time you know it, you'll have so much responsibility, so many different types of questions being asked to you. This brings us to the main question of this video. Should I form an LLC? We'll definitely get into that answer, but if your business has already been producing customers, if you've already had clients, if you're at the beginning stages of planning everything out, an LLC will provide you with major benefits. As a first time business owner, it's important to separate your personal from your business. Having an LLC will protect you and your personal assets from any sort of liabilities or obligations. The beautiful aspect and benefit of having an LLC is that you'll be able to separate your personal from your business. This not only applies to you. If you have another partner or if you have another business owner that is in, in the same business endeavor as you, not only will your personal assets be protected, but that other individuals' assets will be protected as well. If this is you, if you're currently in the stages of setting up your own business, if you've been speaking with potential client, if you're on the edge of adding a new owner or you have a partnership in mind, then LLC is best for you. Now, one of the main reasons why you should consider forming an LLC 
is because you have different types of assets that aren't necessarily connected to the business that you plan to operate. So what I mean by this is say, for example, you want to be able to expand into the online market, like many entrepreneurs are trying to achieve in today's age. Not only are they trying to achieve that, but they are obtaining that goal in and of itself. One of the major reasons why you want to consider forming an LLC is that if you have different types of side gigs going on, Say, for example, you have your own house, but on top of owning your own house, you also have different side hobbies that you like to attend to and that you like to grow. Having an LLC will separate your business endeavors and business actions from those personal endeavors and personal ownership interests. Now, let's go ahead and ask, how much risk does my business really face? Now, this is the real driving reason as to why you should consider registering a LLC. One positive and one benefit is that you'll be able to separate your business from your personal. But when thinking a little deeper into the type of business that you'll be conducting, you have to take into consideration other people and other business entrepreneurs that have gone before you. You have to ask yourself, what did those individuals face? What sort of liabilities did those individuals have? What is the possibility that the business that I want to enter into will have a legal obligation or legal liability? This is very important to keep in mind when deciding whether or not you want to start your business in the first place. But you shouldn't let this hold you back from creating a brand from creating a company that you yourself can build and grow. Don't let the legal liability hold you back from becoming your own boss, from being your own president and CEO, and from being able to hand down a business from generation to generation. The benefits of starting a business definitely outweigh any sort of potential claims. As long as you have the correct business structure set up for yourself, as well as for the future owners of your company. Something to keep in mind is that if you begin to see a lot of interaction with people from around the world, this means that not only is your business doing well, not only is your business growing, but the percentage of risk arises as well. But as I mentioned earlier, you cannot let the risk outweigh the benefits. As long as you have the proper business structure, those risks and those benefits will take care of itself.